Hey guys! Okay, so, um, I haven't made a video in a long time, but I say that in, like, in the beginning of, like, every video I make, because I take, like, the longest breaks, but I'm back regardless, and, um, sorry, I'm looking at the viewfinder, because, like, I can see myself, and my hair is just not cutting it for me. This is kind of a video of, like, I don't know, homework organization, school organization? Like, we're just gonna call it school organization, just because, like, I really don't know how to categorize this, but let's just do a series of like my school organization and we could say like this is like kind of like we're just gonna call it school organization for now just because it's kind of hard to like conceptualize what I'm gonna talk about okay so I've been through like many methods of trying to like keep my stuff together like my work uh, my paperwork and homework and all that stuff and and then I was trying to do I love half inch binders like oh, they're just so convenient because like they're so compact and yeah but now that I'm in college like first year of college and um I just don't like to like keep like carrying different binders and then have to like unhook it like unclip the what is it the you know like the binder thing the rings open the rings put it in the paper sometimes the whole punch is not even or sometimes not even a hole punch in it so it's just like there's it's so tedious so then i was like you know what let's just go back to, so i was like okay let's just go back to like my accordion method accordion folder method and here's my accordion folder i think in a haul like on my school supplies like a while back ago i really don't remember i think it was like summer going into um senior year but anyways this is i think i got it at walmart and it has let me count, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, it has 6 dividers, but but like 7 little compartment spaces, whoops, well, let me just open it up for you, and that's what it looks like. I actually have all my stuff in here right now, so, yeah, um, basically, I just got the 6 one, I don't know why, oh yeah, because I had 6 classes last year, like 6 consecutive periods, like every day, so I just got, um, 6 divider things. And it's working out for me right now, too, even though I have, um, four classes. I only have, like, four classes, but I have two each day. So, yeah. Okay, so basically here are each of the, um, little tab dividers. And they're just, like, they have different colors on it. So to make these tab dividers, these little things, because, um... These change over time and like they didn't have extra little paper things for me to stick in there so I was just like I started to write it on with Sharpie but I just could never get to this tab like to see it fully so I was like you know what let's just try this idea so you can see each of my things this is like general studies class religion English and then this is like essays math and then paper this one I see like you can tell like I wrote on it like I wrote on it with Sharpie but yeah, it just didn't work with like um, the rest of these because like these will change every quarter and I just don't have time to like put a sharpie on it and then take it off and blah blah blah. These are actually the removable, oops, it's upside down, the removable Avery little sticker things that I got at Walmart also. So all I did was I just cut these in half, like folded it and cut them in half and then I just wrote whatever class. And I stuck it on like this and I think it's so adorable. And I tried to do it so it like it wouldn't blend in with the um dividers. So um except for these two, the ELA or uh, English one and the essays because they're the same thing. So or well they go together because like for English we always have to do essays like and then we have to turn in our portfolio with our essays. So I just keep all like the um finished essays in here. And then this just has like all the worksheets. So in the back, you can see they have like a list of um, of the classes you have. I wrote it last year, but again, like that is not practical if you're in college because you basically switch classes every quarter. And so, yeah, I don't know. I should just leave those blank, but I just kept it back there anyways. And then, so then in this pocket back here is where the papers are supposed to go. And I used to keep my papers in, in like these manila folders and the only, I don't know why that was in there, but I used to keep my things in, or my papers in these manila folders. You can just buy manila folders and then I kind of left like, I think half an inch on both sides 
and then I just cut it off, measured cut, and then I cut off the tabs. And then this one was for college paper, and this one's for Wide World, because I used to have like this thing where I was like obsessed with only using Wide World for math and college for everything else. But it's now I'm in like a math where we don't really write on any paper. We kind of, not any paper, but we don't write on binder paper, so I don't really do that anymore. And then, but I keep, I still keep my binder papers back here and I love to fold my papers like this so every time I put new paper out I need to restock on this but this is college ruled so every time I ha like put paper in there I fold them in half I don't know if it's just me you guys do that but I like to just fold it in half because you know like when you write on a hardwood table and then you I don't know the writing is just weirder it's like too thin I don't like it okay anyways my issues so that's just what's in there just binder paper oh where did my test go my next tab says math and of course all that's in there like all of our math work and stuff i keep all the homeworks by date so like in the front would be the very first day of class and then to the end like you know it goes like that so then as i look through it i can just see like it's like categorized by date then next in my essays, I already explained what's in there. It just has all my finished next or my revised essays, like the ones that the teacher gave back. And in my English one, this is kind of important just because like it's like you see like this extra tab. Again, I just stuck a manila folder in it because thank God they fit in here. But this is just a manila folder and I put a essay prompt. So basically like any of the things that has to do with essays, like this is, we're doing like a problem solving essay right now so these are the surveys and these are the questions surveys and questions and just how it's supposed to be laid out the outlines and stuff once i'm done with that essay and stuff and i turn it in then i will just toss it basically or or i'll just keep it into the english section which is behind the essays prompt and again it again it just has like worksheets categorized by date and stuff I'm a whole date person. I don't know. I like that. And then for general studies, it's the same thing, basically. Um, and then in the front, in the very front, since it has seven pockets, the very front has, like, you know, no tabs on it. So I just put, like, the homework that I finished in here. In the front, I will put in my homework that I've done. And I'll do it by order of, um, order of, like, my little tabs so say i had homework in each of these classes but since i have them different days i still put them in the same order of my tabs just so i can keep them in like check and i know where everything is but in the front is always the homework that i finished so i could turn it in and has a place to go okay now for like you're probably wondering like where do you put like your homework your worksheets that you're gonna get for home or that you have for homework i basically just stick it in my backpack because like in my backpack, it doesn't really have any other papers, so I know the papers that are in my backpack, like floating around in my backpack, are homework. But yeah, so that's just how I do it, because I'm just, I'm organized, well, I'm disorganized, I guess. That, that just works for me. It's been working for me for the past quarter, so maybe I should, like, get an update to see, like, how this goes, but it's really working for me. I love this method, and hope you guys can tell me, like, if you tried it. Then leave a comment below and telling me if it worked or not. Sorry, my shoulder like just popped. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.